Greetings, my friends, and welcome back to the channel. I'm Pastor Emeritus, Reverend Ron L. Spratley. Welcome back to Covenant of Grace Ministries. We have a sound bite for you this morning. You came here for the truth. Let me unveil that for you. Today, we're going to spend some time talking about the wisdom pyramid. Our scripture is going to be wisdom is the what principal thing. Therefore, get wisdom and with all thy getting, get understanding. This is Proverbs 4 and 7. We're going to start at the base of this pyramid. This is where most people are trapped at the base of this pyramid. So I want to ask you to pay close attention. In the world that we live in, it's filled with propaganda. Okay? It's filled with propaganda and deception. So let's talk about this base. This is a trap of noise, propaganda, lies, distractions, deception. All of these factors are acting upon us. All of these factors are means of social control. Okay? In the beginning, nobody wanted you to learn how to read and write. Once you learn how to read and write, there's a different level of deception now. It's propaganda. It's lies. It's deception. It's distractions. Okay? Fatal distractions that will affect every area of your life if you bleed the noise, if you bleed the propaganda, if you bleed the lies, if you bleed the distractions, if you bleed the deceptions. They're designed to destroy you. One of your major enemies, you need to understand one of our major enemies is the lack of knowledge. To put it in a different way, lack of knowledge is ignorance of things. And ignorance is very destructive. The scripture teaches us my people are destroyed for lack of knowledge. So at this base here, you are a long way away from wisdom. The base of this is a trap. As we move up, we get better. At this base, we need training, spiritual training that allows us to discern truth from error. The next level in our pyramid is information. A statement about what a known status of a thing. You need data. You need a logical arrangement of a set of related facts. This is information. Information requires analysis. You have to become analytical. All right, you have to use your reasoning. You have to use statistics to see what the data is telling you. The data is interesting. It can show you trends, okay? Now, once we move from information level, let's go up, beliefs. What about beliefs? What do you trust? What do you have faith in? What do you rely on? What do you place your confidence in? Right? Beliefs. You believe something. You don't know it yet, but you believe it. So there are some other steps we need to take. Beliefs that have been what? Tested by life circumstances brings us into experience. You know that you know because you've tried it before and it worked for you. So you have experience, you're gaining skills, all right? The next level here 
is knowledge, facts that lead to understanding. Our scripture talks about, and all thy getting, get understanding. This level, knowledge, you shall know the truth, and the truth shall make you free. Your spiritual freedom is dependent upon the amount of truth that you know, because that's what's going to make you free. So we have to know the truth of the scriptures. We move up to the top of the pyramid where we're working on this channel to bring you up to this place at the top. We want you to know the truth, comprehending. We want you to comprehend the true nature of life. That's what the truth does for you. When you learn to walk in truth, it will lead you into wisdom. You will understand the proper application of spiritual and natural laws, my friends. This is the highest level. Proper, proper application. Know what to use, know what to do, know when to do it, know where to use it. This will give you the proper application. In these perilous times we live in, my friends, these teachings, very important that you grasp them and that you study on them so you can move into this wisdom level to begin to operate at this level. I want to thank you for your time this morning. May God bless you, keep you, until we have the opportunity to bring you more revelation knowledge in the future. Thank you.